In recent months, Rennes was one of the only teams to be able to beat the Giants that are Paris Saint-Germain, the Ligue 1 Conferama. Julien Stéphane handing a start to teenage sensation Eduardo Camavinga. Paris, despite an opening day win against Nîmes, still looked a little bit shaky. Thomas Tuchel giving his young players a chance alongside the experience of Edinson Cavani and Kylian Mbappe. The Neymar saga, however, still hanging like a cloud over the capital club. An early opportunity for Paris as Edinson Cavani headed against the post. El Matador so close to adding to his tally already in the Ligue 1 Conferama. A tally that he would increase shortly afterwards as an error by Damien Da Silva handed him the ball. And a striker of Cavani's quality doesn't need a second invitation to score one like that. It's a dreadful pass back across the face of goal. And Cavani just tucks it in. A huge mistake by the Ren defence. Julien Stéphane's team, however, didn't lie down. And just before half time, managed to get an equaliser. Niang on the turn, beating Alphonse Ariola. Beautiful strike by the Senegalese international. A really good goal. It's a decent cross in, but it's all about that control. Makes a little bit of space for himself and then tucks it away in the bottom corner. Wren, who almost against the run of play, go into half time. All square, but much more needed by the Parisian stars in the second half. An under par performance by Thomas Duchel's men. The German manager unhappy with what he was seeing and it would get even worse for the Parisians. Camavinga with a cross to the back post and Del Castillo with a brilliant flick of the head to give Ren the advantage. The home side scoring at exactly the perfect moment right before half time and then just after the break to go 2-1 up. Ren, of course, who famously beat Paris Saint-Germain in the final of the French Cup. And those demons coming back to haunt the capital players. Meunier's late, doesn't pick up his man. It could have been even worse. Another strike against the post. Ariola was beaten, but it falls, thankfully, in his arms. It is the first time since 2011 that PSG lose one of their opening two league games. A huge win for Rennes, however, one of only three teams to win their opening two games. And they join Nice and Lyon at the top of the standings.